Can you stall real quick while I try to get his gator? You want me to stall? Yeah, talk about something. Dude, I just gave a whole speech. Well, talk about something else. I don't know. All Do right. something. Ladies, this one's for you. Uh, Danny's recently single. He likes long walks no, on no. the beach, fresh mimosas in the morning. That's not what I meant. You spent all that money on me, Harvey. I'm trying to help you out, dude. I hate you. <laughs> Can you talk about something useful, please? I'll talk about the gators. Yeah, that yeah. works. I'll do that. In this arena, we have about 10 different alligators, uh, ranging anywhere from about 6 to 8 feet in length and weighing anywhere from 120 to 200 pounds. Now, that might not seem like a lot of weight for those of you at home with a bow flex, but you got to remember, these animals are about 90% muscle. If you look at Danny, he's about 90% Bud Light and McDonald's. So, uh, <laughs> the odds are Thanks, okay. good for but on a serious note, guys, a little girl came to the show a few years ago, and what she learned here at this show actually helped save her life when she got attacked by an alligator in the wild. So pay attention because you never know what you're going to learn. All right. You got it? I think so. These things are slippy with the way. All right, just, just hold that thought. Hold that over there. Hold what? Just, what are you doing? I'm uh, social distancing. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Say. Glad you came to work today. All right. Show's over, and thanks for coming. <laughs> Not impressed. All right, fine, let's, uh... Oh, he's a little hissed off. Let's do this next part together, okay? Let's all count to three, and on three, I'm gonna get down on him. But before we start counting, do we have anyone here from New York and New Jersey? Yeah. All right, we'll count slow for you. <laughs> okay, all right, here you go. See if he's ready for us. All right, here we go, ready, one. Two, three, all right, we made it. All right, now what? I don't know. I've never made it this far. Um, Anthony, where are you at? Is this the one? Yeah. You better say yes. All right, good. Well, we got his gator up here now. Isaiah was out here telling you guys all that boring history lesson stuff. Uh, he has some good information in there, but he didn't get a chance to tell you everything. One of the hardest parts about catching alligators out in the wild is actually just finding them. They blend in very well with the murky water we have down here in Florida, and they only stick the smallest parts of their body above the water. If you look on top of his head here, you guys see it. Go, picture girl, go ahead, get that. <laughs> here, give a good to that. Just kidding, no. Right here, the eyes. That is the, the, one of the uh, first things they stick above the water when they come up to the surface. And a lot of people always say, if you're ever getting attacked by an alligator, try to poke out his eyes. But that's not the case, because watch. I'll show you guys over here first. You try to poke out a gator's eye, it goes right down to the head. When gator's gone, it pops back up. I do stress the word try though, they have a lot of jaw pressure. If he don't want his mouth open, there's not much I can do about it. But we'll give it a shot. Actually, if you look right here, you guys see this? Kind of looks like there's a whole bunch of fat on his neck there. That's actually not fat, it's jaw muscle. Just like this, ladies. Jaw muscle. <laughs> What's up, girl? <laughs> Alright, here we go. <laughs> there it is, guys. Look inside there. 80 to 82 razor sharp teeth, made for ripping and tearing, not for really chewing. And if you look in the back of the throat, you guys see that flat skin back there? That's cool there. Okay. Oh, Danny, you alright? Yep. <laughs> I think I just peed a little bit. <laughs> Woo! All right. Well, we all saw inside the mouth, right? No. Perfect. No. What do you mean no? What about all these people back here behind you? Y'all didn't see? No. Well, then move. <laughs> Look here, here, here. Look at the tail. It's the most dangerous part. <laughs> Not impressed. All right, hold on. Let me turn it around. Stupid things we do in Florida for minimum wage. <laughs> That's not a joke. The jaws move. They thought it was the top jaw of an alligator, bottom jaw of a crocodile. It's actually the bottom jaw of both animals. So I'm going to show you guys right now, probably the dumbest way I know how. If you've got a camera, get it ready. If this works out, it makes one heck of a snapshot. 
Yeah, guys, get those cameras ready either way, because I've seen this before, and if it goes horribly wrong, it's still going to make an awesome snapshot. Why are you here today? You know, just moral support. For who? Go Gators! I hate you. Alright, this horse wants to get his bottom jaw. If it doesn't work, watch it have his mind. All up to this alligator here. Once he relaxes, we'll be able to pull this off, hopefully. All right, as you guys can see, that mouth is creeping open. Get your hands back, Danny. All right, get your photos while you can, folks. Oh, hold on, uh, dude over there in the blue shirt, is he smiling? That Danny, smile for him, bro. Get no. me on Snapchat, Instagram, all that. Smile. Come on, dude. All right, let's get constipated. You know what? Let's get your photos, folks. Hey, wait, wait, hold up. That one dude's changing the Snapchat. Post. No, no, no. You usually get like a thunderstorm applause after that stun. Oh, wow. Where did that come from? What was that? A no Normally people say throw money at me after that stun. I'm just kidding. That's my other job. You know what? Let me leave you guys for one last thing real quick. What do you ever do if the gator's chasing you? You run, right? Run away. Do not run zigzags, though. I used to believe that myself. That's a total lie. Have you ever tried running zigzags? No. It's difficult. Kids, you'll find out when you turn 21. Run straight, okay? Alligators only run like five to seven miles per hour. You can outrun an alligator. If you don't feel like running, uh, trip your friend. That works too. Now, all seriousness, guys, when you're walking around this park today, uh, make sure you look for all the signs about Gatorland Global. It's all the conserva conservation efforts we do around the world to help save crocodilians because we really do love them. Uh, so that is the end of this show. So let's give it up for the real side of Sally Gator right here. He did an awesome job. Keep that round of applause going for your Gator Wrangler, Danny. Thank you, guys. Thank you. All right, guys. Y'all enjoy the show?